Greetings fellow YouTubers, Irv Lindsay here. How you doing? Welcome to Irv's Garden. <laughs> uh, in today's video, I'm going to tell you the story of Irv's Garden. I'm going to tell you the story of Irv's garden. What does that mean? Well, uh, until recently, nobody cared about Irv's garden. Um, in um, May of 2020, um, YouTube did something and sent a lot of subscribers to my channel. And um, overnight, I got several thousand subscribers. And so... <laughs> the story of Irv's Garden um, really starts with my main channel, Irv TV, and uh, it's a channel all about Cincinnati history. And uh, like a lot of you guys, I decided one day that I wanted to plant a garden. And so I didn't have a garden bed at that time. I just had an empty backyard, but I had never lived anywhere where I was able to do a garden. So I decided I was going to plant tomato plants in my front garden bed. And that's what we did. 2016, had lived in Cincinnati for two years, uh, had been planting for uh, the first two years. I had planted early girl tomatoes and some cucumbers and a watermelon, had a small water, watermelon patch, a patch that I got one watermelon out of. I did a video and I posted it and nobody watched it. <laughs> I posted some videos about planting day and my tomatoes and it was fun. I didn't expect anybody to watch them. So uh, eventually I realized they didn't fit on my main channel page on Irv TV, which I do Cincinnati history videos, urban exploring, stuff like that. Those guys didn't want to hear anything about gardening. So I just did another channel and I threw all my gardening videos on it and every now and then I would do a garden update and throw it over there. But I'm not, I'm not going to lie guys, I didn't have anybody watching those videos. So I just ignored them. Um, and I filmed a lot of garden updates that I didn't produce. I still got the videos. Uh, stuff that I didn't really put up because nobody was watching it. So, um, you know, I wasn't, there was, if, you're, if, if nobody watches something, what's the point in sharing it, right? <laughs> When I started my garden, I was unemployed. In 2018, I got a job and that pretty much killed my gardening experience that year. Very stressful, not a lot of time to deal with it. It just went on without me, I didn't care. Because of the good location and plenty of underground water, the garden survived. And it even came back the next year without me, like I wasn't even here, because uh, I have mostly heirloom plants. So, uh, skip forward to May of 2020, YouTube did something where they, um, uh, they sent tons of traffic to my channel and I picked up, um, I picked up like 3000 subscribers. And, um, so there's a lot of you guys out there wanting to see more videos. So the good news is I've got this backlog of gardening videos that I filmed and didn't really produce or upload. So a lot of what you're going to be seeing on Irv's garden which is based out of Cincinnati. I live on the west side of Cincinnati. Is uh, those a lot of those old videos about gardening that nobody used to care about, except maybe my mom, and that's it. So I've got those. I'm going to be posting a lot of videos. Now, the garden updates you're watching right now, I'm going to tell you a secret. <laughs> uh, those garden updates are from 2017. I filmed a gardening series on my main channel and nobody watched it either and I kind of gave up on it. So I've been posting those because this year, this is what Irv's garden looks like. Weeds, nothing but weeds. I don't have garden updates to give you guys right now. So what I'm going to do, um, this is Memorial Day weekend. I am going to try to do some weeding out here in the garden so I can put some plants in the ground because it's about that time of year here in Cincinnati. I don't put plants in the ground till after May 15th. So that came and went about a week ago. <laughs> um, so that's my plan today. Look look at this right here. That That's how abandoned my garden is. Um, <laughs> but fear not, I've got plenty of videos I filmed that I haven't posted. Um, I'm gonna repost my, um, I'm gonna repost my watermelon video from 2016. 
it's actually a pretty good video. Once again, nobody watched it. <laughs> um, and I have some other gardening updates. I've got plenty of gardening updates. I'm trying to match them to the month. So um, I went ahead and released February, March, and April already. And I've got, I've got the May updates coming out. I do have a July, a June, July, and August. And then I did some filming in 2018 as well for videos, uh, for, for garden updates. The two things about my garden to know is that in 2017, I built the, I built the raised bed and I did the barrels. Uh, now you'll see, you should see that the barrels you'll be able to see and if you've watched my garden updates being posted right now, you'll see where I did the barrels. But then in 2018, and the guys I've dug and dug and dug, I can't find the video where I made these. These are big, big barrels. I got three big white barrels, cut them in half. And um, I do not have a video showing me doing that. But that's the general outline I have. These barrels here, I have a bunch of five gallon buckets and I have the white half barrels and then I have the raised bed. So as I'm posting videos, you will always see the raised bed, unless I'm out front in the front garden in the front flower bed. Um, now, for those of you who are wondering, I do live on the west side of Cincinnati. I have no HOA here. This is my, my house is almost 100 years old. I can pretty much do what I want within the limits of what the city of Cincinnati enforces, which those of you that live in Cincinnati know, the city of Cincinnati enforces nothing. <laughs> Um, my, my neighbors are my only, my only barriers and they're pretty nice as, as long as I don't let it grow wild and look nasty. Um, my backyard is on actually, if I'm being honest, if I were to go stand by my back fence back here, you can see that I'm actually up even with the back of my house. I'm right at nose level with these windows. So I'm on a, I have pretty good drainage back here. Uh, and because way up there is a street, I've got some pretty good underground water sources going and I'm never in need of water. So anyway, um, I'm going to document my comeback. Starts with me today uh, doing some weed eating and so forth so guys thanks for watching all those of you out there who are new to my channel it's awesome i'm going to share a lot of my gardening videos with you guys um i have a pretty low budget uh way that i do things um the most i spent was on my garden bed here i had to spend a bunch of money on lumber and some really good um <laughs> so obviously some good soil because the weeds love it <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Uh, if you're new to my channel, please click that bell. You get notifications when I post videos. I'm going to try to post a video a week uh, just because of my limitations of what I've got. If I post too many too quick, then we will run out of videos. And uh, as I do stuff here in the garden, I'll also post videos live. I'll make sure those are posted so you'll know. They'll be labeled 2020 or something so you'll know they're, they're current. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Everybody enjoy the rest of your week. Keep fighting a good fight, and I'll see you in the next video.